by the fact. <laughs> if you want to see the tribe. It's, well, try, the human it's, try, it's, it's called getting back at the old man. <laughs> uh, Bill, there has been a lot of talk in recent months, a lot of talk, and even, even the fact has made its way to a couple of TV stories I've seen. Big bands on their way back, just like in the 40s and the 50s. People are beginning to enjoy that kind of music again. Uh, should that occur, is that going to help or hurt jazz as we now know it today? It, it will help the music. Big band music is not particularly uh, a form of jazz that you will find in your average club. Uh, that particular music is found in quintets and, and maybe up to an octet. That's about it. But the Village Vanguard, for thousands of years in New York City, the Village Vanguard has always had on a Monday night uh, a big band in there. I've, I've seen in the Village Vanguard, which holds 140 people, uh, Gil Evans and, and 19, 18 pieces. Uh, when you talk about big bands, you may be talking about Count Basie, Mercer Ellington, but you also may be talking about Gil Evans. Uh, you, you may also be talking about, um, oh my word, uh, you'll fill in the name later. But Toshiko and right. I can't, they're California right. names. Well, he's got those, bands, those bands are playing now. They're gigging around in the traditional spots. Mm -hmm. But uh, the word seems to be that we're looking at the possibility of big bands returning to the dancing casinos and the more lush clubs. Uh, we've already got the bands you mentioned. We, we're, we're familiar with those bands, yeah. especially here in Los Angeles. But people seem to think that the trends that, that are currently rock, hard rock, punk, are going to go back to big bands because people just want to dance and enjoy the music again. I think you'll find all over that no matter what fads and crazes come in, but the the established of all things will always be big bands, no matter what. Um, in closing, I have one favorite story, which applies to big bands coming back. It's the end of the world, no one's alive, and we see the camera panning in with all of the usual things blowing around the dust and whatnot. And it comes up on a tombstone. And the tombstone reads, Jazz, it broke even. <laughs>